This was a day at the opera for hundreds of school children in the Philadelphia area. It's part of a special education program that uses opera to teach a host of subjects. Lisa Thomas Laurie is here with the story tonight. Lisa. And it's a great story, Jim. It's the East Coast premiere of the opera Silent Night. This afternoon, 2,000 students made their way to the Academy of Music to see a modern masterpiece. These 5th through 12th graders and a few college students from all over the Philadelphia area donned their finest attire for today's production. For most, it was their first opera experience. Is this your first opera? Uh, yes, it is. Uh, hopefully not my last. It was the final dress rehearsal for Silent Night, the Pulitzer Prize winning opera that takes place during one of the bloodiest wars in history. Enemies become brothers as Scottish, French, and German officers defy their superiors and negotiate a miraculous Christmas Eve truce during World War I, I think it was. Very good, very good. And they stopped for a second to just talk, and they, they made peace. It's the very first opera for American composer Kevin Putz. Approach it the way I approach any piece. Try to do the best I can and make it something that's engaging and that I'm happy with. Opera Philadelphia's Sound of Learning program is a five-week music education program that uses the opera to teach everything from the history of the time period to the literary themes found within the story. By intermission, the students were totally absorbed. I think it's amazing on how they can get their voice so high that they don't need a microphone. I like when a girl, like, they, like, kiss it at me. <laughs> Some of them, it changes their lives. We've had people become opera singers that sort of came to our Sounds of Learning program over 13 years ago. I liked every single part of it. It was fun to see just how uh, they got into the opera today. Silent Night opens to the public on Friday, February 8th, with five performances at the Academy of Music through February 17th. For more information about the opera, about tickets, our viewers, Jim, can go to 6abc.com. Should we go? Yeah, it's exciting stuff. Really enjoyed it. All right, thank you, Lisa. <laughs>